Yeah, I am. Oh, oh I got hair in my. Ugh. I don't know how to hold this thing. The land of happy little trees. Now we'll start just making little X's, just little crisscross strokes, that easy. I think I'll have some water in this painting today. I love water. Let's have still water. So pull from the outside to in. And right up in the corners, I'm just going to add a small amount of the Prussian blue, like that. And maybe, yeah, right in here. Just decide where you think this little mountain lives in your world and drop it in. Painting is a very individual thing. We all see nature through different eyes. Don't be afraid of it because it's dark. We're going to put a few little highlights on it. But you decide where all the little protrusions on your mountain live. The little bumps. To take and reflect a mountain right into the water. Now we're just looking for a basic little reflection here. Yeah, there we go. Maybe right in here there's a little little foothill lives right here. Just a little footy hill, right at the base of the mountain. And then I'm just going to take and grab that and lift upward. I want to look like little trees, a little closer to us, but living very far away. And with that, we'll just put the indication that you like. Maybe in our world, we're going to have a big tree. But don't worry about it. Learn to compose as you paint. Learn to take advantage of what happens. You need a reflection, so just pull it straight down. <laughs> straight down. It's most important that it goes straight. We'll put a few highlights on this little rascal. Maybe in our world here. Yeah. Little stones all in one stroke. Like that. that easy. I'd like to wish you happy painting and God bless my friend. Make this here with all the ice on in the